all the colors that I have today, this rainbow of colors, are Deco Art Americana. And um, I'm going to mix them a one to one ratio with Oatrol Easy Flow, which is similar to Floetrol. This is a European company and they offer their product through Amazon or through their website. The swiping technique, you're using actually very little paint with this method where I like to do the swiping feathery kind of look. And um, all my colors that I have mixed up, I mixed up in a cup first with the Oatrol 1 to 1. And with the bottled paints, you really don't need to add water at all. The only time you might would add water is if you use a metallic. And I have three metallics that are copper, splendid gold, and rich espresso. Otherwise, everything is just paint and Oatrol. I'm, I have kind of a general idea of what I want to do. Tropical, leafy, but very colorful. And uh, I'm known to do kind of the feathery kind of look. And, and I'm going to do that swiping style. But I'm going to try to do it a little bit different today. And all the colors do have a drop of spot on treadmill lubricant. Probably a drop per ounce of paint and Oatrol mixture. I do shake all my bottles which probably uh, lends to help with these smaller cells. I'm not going to use all these colors today, but there are, they are in squeeze bottles to my right here, and I'm going to just go with my gut as I paint because I do like to just kind of let it flow, and I'm not going to talk while I paint. I am going to mention that uh, I'm going to put a light coat of black on the canvas initially. This is not like a typical pour painting where I'm going to be tilting it and all that stuff so there really won't be any spillage on the table but I do let the paint go over the edge if the design takes it that way and so there might be some on the edges. Next layers, I am not going to use the pull trowel. I'm going to switch to the smaller trowel because I want more control. And I'm going to vary the colors and they're going to overlap each other. And I'm curious how that will play out, but I want to use my scraper as my tool and because I can do a much lighter pressure than I can with the pull trowel. That requires gliding over the surface pretty firmly and with this you can just do a very soft feather touch. So that's my next layer is to be done using this with more of a feathery touch.
So what I was trying to paint in an abstract kind of way is the croton plant. Someone had requested that. It's a very tropical multicolored leaf. Comes in reds and greens. There's different variations. Some, some of them are just strictly greens and yellows. This one had a lot of red in it. And so I just wanted a kind of a variation of those colors and so there it is. There's my croton plant and it's kind of wild and all over the place but I hope you enjoyed it and if you like please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.